The lives of Broadway performers are busy. They only have a few short hours between their matinee and evening performances, and they're giving us an inside look, from grabbing a bite to unwinding, plus a backstage tour. Have you ever wanted to see what we do in the time sandwich between performances? Follow along and find out. This is Broadway Sandwich. Hello, gorgeous. Today we're at a show about Fanny Bryce, a girl from the Lower East Side of Manhattan who's told she'll never become a star. But Fanny, of course, proves everyone wrong and becomes one of the greatest entertainers of all time. We're a funny girl. The original theatrical production and movie made Barbara Streisand a star and earned her her first Oscar. The show features musical theater hits like Don't Rain in My Parade and People. Today we're meeting up with Leslie Plesner. Funny Girl is Leslie's ninth Broadway show. She's a true triple threat, which has kept her in high demand. Leslie and I have been friends ever since we were in the Broadway company of An American in Paris together. She's the best. Uh, Leslie! Hey! Hello. Oh, it's so good to see you. You too, how was your first show? It was great. Okay, I don't want to rain on your parade, mm. but you do have a second show later. I'm I so do. glad we get to hang out, but I what know. are we doing in the time sandwich between your matinee and evening show? I thought first, let's get a little bite at Dolly Barton just Good, around the I'm corner. Starving. I'm great. so hungry. Okay. And then I heard about this amazing place called Portal that has Ooh. recovery tools. Oh, Sauna, I love it. Ice plunge. Who um, we'll couldn't use a little rejuvenation? Yeah, a little rejuvenation. Sounds good to me. And then if there's a little bit of time, yeah. let's learn some showgirl choreography. Okay, you're naturally going to a bevel. Yeah. Perfect. And then I'll take you backstage. I can't wait. Let's go. Let's go. Boom. Oh, I love these. Okay, so over oysters, you gotta tell me how you got into the business. Pretend you don't know me. Oh, okay. My mom put me in Jenny's Dance School, I think, or Jenny's Dance Studio, a local dance studio. When Sounds I was like a, a great school. Fun fact, I went to Miss Mona School of Dance, Horseback Riding, and Voice in Roanoke, Virginia for a summer. So just, yeah, Wait, keep voice, going. acting, horseback riding, uh -huh. all in one? Perfect. Yeah, don't they normally go together? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so Jenny's. Went to Jenny's and then really fell in love with dance. Went to a proper ballet school. I loved mm -hmm. pretending that I was someone else. I also loved the discipline. And then when I was in middle school, I started doing shows and then was introduced to the world of musical theater. Decided, I think I want to do this professionally. And I got lucky, this is non-traditional, but moved to New York and within a couple of months of being in the city, I auditioned for a show called Finian's Rainbow. And on our last day, we had a party and they told us that it was going to Broadway. So it was a Broadway. nice closing night gift. Yeah, You're yeah. Like, Surprise, what? we're going to the St. James. I was like, yeah. what? I was 21. I just moved to New York. I was so excited. Huh. Um, and have thankfully and luckily steadily worked on Broadway since yeah. then. Work, ribs, <laughs> yes, they're delicious. How many other Broadway shows did you do? Which ones? A show called Follies, starring Bernadette Peters. I've heard of her. her. Yeah, casual. Yeah. Chaplin. Oh, yeah. Starring Rob McClure. Rob McClure, one of the best people in the business. Love. Uh, Cinderella. Mm -hmm. Honeymoon in Vegas. After that, I think Think an American in Paris? Sounds right. Followed by Hello Dolly, Tootsie, and now Funny Girl. So that's nine? Nine. Wow. What would you say to a younger version of yourself? Mm. Trust that if, if you are kind, if you work hard, if you're a good person and you're fun to be around, just be present, enjoy the experience, jobs will come. And just enjoy the fact that you're in a Broadway show. It's amazing. Instead of constantly thinking about what the next thing is gonna be. Okay, so let's talk about understudying. Whew. Yeah, baby, because it's a whole thing. I think about a show as like a hamster wheel that's going, and as an understudy, you just double gotta hop wheel. on it and you gotta double go dutch. Yeah. double dutch. It's also fun to exercise different muscles. Hmm. So you're in your track, you're in your show every night, and then you get this opportunity to do something completely different. You're not dancing, you're actually singing three songs on Broadway. You have to act in scenes opposite David Hyde Pierce. It's fun, you get to yeah. wear someone else's shoes for a night. Well, um, that was delicious. Mm. Should we go to the recovery place now? Please. Mm. Uh, 
I started a company during the pandemic. Our whole business completely shut down, obviously. Yeah. Tell me about and it. we had all this creative energy, and I didn't know what to do with it. I have 30 students who want to take a musical theater jazz class. I'll teach them rep from Hello Dolly. Yeah. So now we're doing that virtually and in person. I love meeting young, hungry, hardworking, talented people. Yeah. And when I do meet kids like that, I will go to like any end to make their dreams possible. Like that inspires me. That yeah. makes me excited. That's really beautiful. Yeah. Can you give me a little sample of your off key singing? I used to do this to purposefully make you laugh uh -huh. backstage yeah. at American in Paris. It worked every time. Well, do, what's, what song should we do? We could do like. Happy ha birthday? Yeah, happy birthday, Mary. Happy birthday, dear Karen. Ooh. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> it's so stupid. perfectly wrong. So bad. You're amazing. Open. Ga, ga, ga. Hi, hey guys, Hi. I'm so excited to have you here today. Thank you for having us, we can't wait. Oh, you guys have no idea what you're in for. So we're okay. gonna start with the Norma Tech boots, right. which, which are a compression massage. So it's gonna help with lymphatic drainage, clear out lactic acid, help boost your metabolism. Love it. Super, super relaxing. Look, brand new legs. This takes wrinkles away. Get out of my okay. way. Okay, <laughs> come on in. You guys ready? Ready. ready. All right, I'm gonna hand you guys eye patches. Ooh, thank so this you. is all about sensory deprivation. As soon as you cover up the eyes, okay. the brain instantly starts to transfer from the sympathetic into the parasympathetic nervous system. <gasps> Bye, world. Oh my god, this is amazing. Oh. Good morning. Good morning. How wow. do you feel? Oh my god, that was incredible. So rested. That was my favorite thing we've done. Okay, so you ready? Yes. You got like a count of three? Five, six, six seven, eight! eight. Woo! Oh. Oh. Oh, that's cold. Okay, that's cold. Deep breaths. Okay. How long are we supposed to stay in here? Oh, very I just lean back and enjoy. Okay. I'm so enjoying this. Oh, oh this my is God. Ah. Okay. This is going to be the best second show of your life. It really is. Oh, wait, my legs oh. are going to be numb, but it's going to be really great. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, good to go. We're coming up, we're coming up. Are we getting up? Let's go. Okay, yeah. let's go. Oh. We got to do a show. Never felt better. Oh, okay. Here we go. All right, Leslie, you ready for your 60-second sandwich? I'm nervous, yes, I'm, I'm ready. I'm putting 60 seconds on the clock. Answer as many questions as you can. Okay, got it. Ready to roll? Let's do it. Let's do it. Well, here we go. Uh, okay, um, I dance at Vladimir's wants to know. You're so talented. Well, that's really nice. Uh, what do you like to do best, sing or dance? Uh, both. Both, Can't you heard decide. her. Dream dinner guest, dead or alive? Meryl Street. Mm. Do you keep playbills from every show you see? No. Oh, well, there you mm -hmm. have it. Uh, we, don't, just we don't need cruise. clutter. No, no we clutter. don't. No, no Marie Kondo. Minimalist. Just Cruise One wants to know who is your favorite Real Housewife. That is impossible. Ramona Singer, Dorinda. I'm a Bethany personally. You love Bethany. Coffee or tea? Coffee. Black? No, almond oat. Almond oat. You're an almond oat. An almond I oat. love it. <laughs> Ever fully blanked on stage? Yes. What happened? Improvise, recover. Keep Got going. Got it together Keep and moving. kept moving. 20 seconds left. Ever fully, oh, health, healthiest habit? Sleep. Sleep. Favorite New York City restaurant for dinner before or after a show? Gallagher's. Ooh. G. Conley wants to know, ever accidentally said, sang someone else's part? Uh, probably. Oh, yeah, and who cares? Yeah. Uh, favorite song? <laughs> favorite song, um, No One Is Alone. Oh, so beautiful from Into the Wood? Yes. Uh, do you plan bathroom breaks during the show? I don't plan them, but we have to go pee pee sometimes. And they happen! They happen. Way to go, that's one minute! Woo! That was beautifully said! <laughs> okay, walk this way. Walk this way. It feels so rejuvenated uh, and I know. fresh. That was My body lovely. feels so good. Do you think you would teach me that dance movie you promised me earlier? Yes, such a little showgirl choreo. Little showgirl choreo. Let's Come on, go. let's okay. do it. Okay, let me got? put this down. Ready? Okay, okay. Most importantly is the bevel. You know what yeah, the bevel is. Yeah, yeah, let's go. You really want to think about the body being like a pear shape. Everything gets really tight. Wing that heel forward. Yep. Gorgeous. Think yep. expensive. You're wearing a million dollars worth of diamonds dripping. Wow. And let the breeze underneath your arms really sort of guide you as we're going to take four steps forward. That's so elegant. Yeah? And a one, two, three, 
Four, let's take a suit new turn with our right foot forward. Yes. Gold. Four more steps, expensive. Ooh. Expensive, expensive. Let's turn around, bring everything together. Ooh. Burst the flowers open. Oh, oh I fell. Oh. <laughs> I'm not it now. I'm Showgirl not it. I'm not dreams, it. expensive, expensive. That's all it is, honey. I love you that. love. When they announced that Funny Girl was coming to Broadway, I got really excited, and my ears right away were like, do, yeah. do, 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 yeah. radar. I love a revival, as we know. Me too. I've done a few revivals. I knew that Funny Girl also featured tall, leggy showgirls, which I do a lot of those shows. Yeah. And what do you <laughs> love about doing revivals? I love doing a revival because there's so much nostalgia involved. Mm. For instance, Funny Girl, I grew up watching the movie. I know the score. I love Julie Stein. There's almost that relationship with the audience that they know what this is, but they're excited to maybe see a new version of it. It feels like a big hug. You can feel them really lean in and get excited, sometimes sing along. Right. Hilarious. Yes. <laughs> Who told you you're allowed to rain on my parade? It's just fun. So you kind of have a head start with the audience. Yes, yeah. yes. Oh, um, before I get out of here, can you take me to your dressing room? Yes. Ooh, let's roll. How many times a show do you do this? Too many. <laughs> I love it. Here we are. This is good. You can show girl everywhere show girl around here. Everywhere. And here we are. Oh, and Top look, bump. there's MJ. So on Saturday nights, we do a Saturday night scream where we like wave and sing to each other. That's really they sweet. Pop out the yeah. That's These really are nice. snacks. Oh, hey, snack box. Hey, cheese it. That's really you gotta good. have a mid show snack. You yeah. Know I love a mid show snack. Most musicals in Act Two, they're wrapping up the love story between the especially principal revivals. characters, especially revivals. Right. So, usually have a little break. So, I like to order sushi in Act Two, and we call it Act Two Sheep. So, off camera a minute ago, you said that you were alerted that you might be doing a role that you don't even understudy tonight. Yes. Tell us a little bit about that. So, I got um, a text that was like, hey, would you be willing to go in for Emma tomorrow? It's not a part that I understudy. I don't know the lines. I don't know the blocking, I don't know anything, I don't have costumes, I don't have hair, like... I'm sweating. I'm sweating. Yeah. Um, no, but I was like, sure, we'll figure it out if it has to be that. You know, it's... It, I'm a yes person. If it keeps the show up and running, let's do it. You know, that's show business. Yes. It's unpredictable, it's live theater, but... And the company's so supportive, they would be amazing, they would shove with love. And they know that you'd be wonderful. Explain what shoved... Shove with love is. Shove with love is when an understudy or someone who's not normally in a track is in, and maybe they're not exactly on them on their marks. Mm. You'd politely just oh, shove with love and bring you, so you over. Yes. Now yes. I know where I am. Oh, you're gonna that's go over so one sweet. more this way. That's ah, the most loving and shove I've ever gotten. We're gonna come Ooh. this way. That's a shove with love. Yes, that's sweet. With love is the most important yeah, thing. Yeah, Because if you love. just shove, we don't like that. I think I'm gonna shove with love. Oh, that's so nice. I'll do a little shove and a showgirl walk. Oh, so, it's a double. Double, yes, it's yes. It's a showgirl shove show with girl love. Showgirl exit. Gorge. We're putting you in, Garen. You're Have on tonight. Have a great tonight. one. Bye. No, I can't do it. I'm busy. See ya. <laughs>